Hiya, it's Mark here again. So, first of all, before you serve the uh, two months notice to move out of the property, the A6 form, you've got to make sure the tenant has an up-to-date how to rent checklist. This gives them all the rights for the tenants and, their obli and your obligations and what the tenant's obligations are to live in the property. So you've got to make sure two or three days before you serve them notice that they have got the up-to-date form. Okay. Now, how are you going to serve that? You've got to get them to sign for it or post it, first class post, registered, so they don't argue to say that they haven't received it. If you're going to put it through the letterbox, put it through the letterbox, but also make sure you take a picture of it going through the letterbox with a timestamp on it. So same again, they can't complain that they haven't received it. That's the first thing you've got to do. Now, when you do the section six form, the two months notice to quit or move out you got to do the same again you've got to prove to the judge that you've actually served it so you can do it registered post to the property you can hand deliver it put it through the letterbox make sure you timestamp it if you hand it to the tenant make sure they sign for it so they can't say they haven't had it what I normally do, I walk up to the door, take a picture of it as if I'm putting it through the letterbox. So, you, so, so you've got notice of it, that you, what you've done. And then I knock on the door and if the tenant comes, most of them won't sign it. Most of them aren't talking to you by then. But they can't complain that they haven't got it. You can also do it by email to them all the notices as long as it's in your tenancy agreement that you're allowed to send it by email now you could do all three and then they can't argue that they haven't had it thank you good luck